Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm Gail, I'm a fashion and lifestyle content creator. Today I'm bringing to you classic black and white looks. We're gonna style them today. I know that everyone has black and white in their closet, but today I'm bringing you more elevated pieces. I know that everybody has like black leggings, you got your white t-shirt, you have your white button down, you have your black jeans. But today we're gonna kick, kick it up a notch and we are going to style them a little differently. We are going to style them with pieces that are a little bit different, a little different. So before we get into it, let's talk about my outfit. This purple pajama set, which is also loungewear, so you can wear it in your house, you can also wear it out in the street, is from Montserrat. I, this is one of my favorite loungewear sets. If this is a button down top, we have pants, they got pockets. I'm styling this today with gold booties. I'm also wearing jewelry from Lapo Lounge. This first piece right here is from Lapo Lounge. It's from my friend Opal, pretty new brand. Go check her out on Instagram. It's L-A-P-O Lounge. And you can go find her on Instagram. Also, I am wearing a layered necklace from Ana Luisa Jewelry. Before we get into the outfit, if you like this video, subscribe to my channel, hit that notification button so you know exactly when I post, and give me a thumbs up if you like this video. So let's get into the first outfit. This top that I'm wearing is from Marigold Shadows. It's not your typical white button down shirt. We've got some exaggerated sleeves. We've got you know the nice puff sleeves very difficult to iron but i haven't tried steaming it but that's another story and i'm styling this with faux leather leggings and also a waist vest that is also from marigold shadows this vest is a little kind of wish i had gotten it in medium because it's a little it's a little tight but i'm making it work suck everything in but just make it work and i style this with tall faux leather boots absolutely love love how this outfit turned out i wore this to my sister's birthday party and it was like a last minute decision but i'm so happy i was able to put this together that was the first time that i actually wore this outfit and love how it turned out the second look is a little simpler but also pretty chic i'm styling a white button down shirt with a black vest and a black faux leather skirt it's not a skirt y'all it's a skirt and they're not shorts either skirt so i'm styling this with over the knee boots these boots i got from zara they're sold out now but i wanted to style these boots and i was trying to find something that would look really great with it and i realized that i had this skirt that i have not worn in a while i think i probably wore it once and i was like you know what let me pull this back out let me try it again i also styled it with this charles and keith belt bag really really loved how this turned out up next we have a simple black ribbed dress that i style with an open back cutout blazer now when i saw this blazer on the coles website i was like i need this blazer because it's very different the blazer part of it the black part of it is actually blazer material however the white part is actually shirt it's like a button down shirt so even the buttons signify that the buttons on the top are a little bit bigger in order to accommodate for that heavier material and then the buttons at the bottom are a little lighter to accommodate the shirt like material i style this with knee high boots the, the boots have a little heel to them very comfortable rubber sole this entire look is from kohl's even this bag this absolutely cute bag it's this bag is really adorable love it this outfit to me is definitely a more elevated black and white look it's not your typical look only because of the style of the blazer the fact that it's cut out at the back is not a typical blazer which is one thing that stood out for me it's different and that's one thing that i love about this outfit now moving on to the next outfit we've got a black and white shirt but not your typical black and white shirt this is now color block and we have the white with the black pocket on one side and then we have the black on the other side i mean how cool is this top really and i styled this with black slacks that i picked up from zara and i decided to leave the shirt out because i love how this looks 
paired it with a pair of black heels and I think that this look, that's it. It needs nothing else. It looks put together, it looks elevated, it looks chic. And I absolutely love this look. The next look is this black and white zip collar sweater. This I picked up from Amazon Fashion. Y'all, the, the quality of this sweater is amazing. It is so good. So happy that I decided to pick this up because uh, I know that I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of this. And you know that black and white stripes are trending right now. So this is definitely on trend for the winter season. And I decided to style this again with my skirt, my faux leather skirt. I also decided to style this with my Tamara Mellon suede boots. I can totally wear this in the winter also because I'm sure I'm not going to want to have my legs uncovered, but I can just put on a pair of tights, you know, throw on an overcoat and I'm good. I'm good to go. Let's move on to the last look. This final look I wore to a brand holiday party. I put this together last minute. Love how it turned out. So I basically styled white pants that I had picked up from Zara over the summer and I styled it with a black shirt that I, it's a sheer button down shirt that I don't remember where I got it from but I saw it in my closet and I was like okay this could work. So I style it with this blazer, another cut out blazer and it's like a crisscross blazer that I also got from Marigold Shadows. Love how different this is. Style it with the silver booties this little bag silver sequin bag that i also got from amazon fashion i'm absolutely obsessed with this look so great for the holidays um not sure if i'll be able to wear it again i would hope that i can but definitely definitely a good look to have for the holidays y'all that is it that's it for the black and white looks um thank you so much for tuning in thank you for watching and i will catch you guys next time bye